वेलकम ऑल इन दिस लेक्चर वी आर गोइंग टू स्टडी अबाउट डी जनरेट मोड्स सो वेन एवर टू और मोर मोड्स हैव द सेम कट ऑफ फ्रिक्वेंसी देन दैट मोड्स आर कंसिडर्ड एज डी जनरेट मोड्स सो वेन एवर टू और मोर मोड्स have same cut off frequency then we can say that these modes are considered as degenerate modes now let us have a look at the cut off frequency of the wave guide so the general formula for the cut off frequency of wave guide is given as it is denoted by fc where fc is equals to c over 2 under the root m over a square plus n over b square here c is the velocity of light in the vacuum and a and b represents the dimension of wave guide now in case of rectangular wave guide the te mn mode and tm mn mode are also known as degenerate modes so in case of rectangular wave guide the te m n mode and also the tm m n mode is considered as degenerate mode why these two modes are considered as degenerate modes because as we discussed that degenerate modes have same cut off frequency that's why this temn and this tmmn mode have same cut off frequency that's why we considered it as degenerate modes let us discuss this degenerate mode in more detail by the help of an example so here is an example of te 11 mode and also tm 11 mode so here the value of m in this case is equals to 1 because here te m and representation is there and in place of m we write 1 and in place of n we have written 1 only so n value is also 1 and here also m value is 1 and n value is 1 and if we calculate the cut off frequency for these two modes then they have the same cut off frequency that's why we can say that these two are considered as degenerate modes so we can easily find out the pair of degenerate modes on the basis of the cut off frequency by the help of this formula only so this is the basic introduction about the t generate mode if you like my videos then do subscribe my channel and please hit the like button thank you